the IG report, only a portion of the IG report actually is out. And uh, this is, this is bad. This is um, bad. So let's go ahead and, um, wow, McCabe, the criminal. He's a criminal. Former FBI director is faulted in scathing inspector general report. I'm reading from the New York Times, by the way. The Justice Department issued, Inspector General issued, delivered to Congress a highly critical report that accused Andrew G. McCabe of repeatedly misleading investigators. Friends, this is called obstruction of justice. Um, he, as he was under oath many times, this is now proof that McCabe is a criminal. McCabe misled federal investigators. There are actually um, statutes. There are actually statutes on oh, misleading investigators. Yeah, this is called obstructing justice. This is called um, felony perjury. This is called crimes. So McCabe, Andrew McCabe, is a, he's a criminal. And um, I'm telling you, CNN isn't going to cover this. So let's just, let's just continue. The inspector general said that when investigators asked whether he had instructed aides to provide information in 2016 to report the Wall Street Journal, Mr. McCabe said he did not authorize the disclosure and did not know who did, but he did a approve it. Friends, this is a felony. This is not a joke here. <laughs> he lied to the FBI. McCabe lied to the FBI. Do you understand what a – and this is not the full report. McCabe also altered the 302s framing General Flynn for crimes he never committed. That hasn't come out yet. This isn't even the, the big bombshell. This isn't even the full enchilada. This is just um, – this is unbelievable, unreal. McCabe lied to federal investigators. This is called – Obstruction of justice. McCabe is a criminal and committed multiple felonies. Second special counsel. And again, this is not my characterization. I told you this IG report uh, was going to be a uh, blockbuster. I've been waiting for it for a long time. So uh, let's just, you know, Cernovich was talking to you about, about the blockbuster. And um, so here, I'll just retweet me from March 14th. I mean, this is, this is, uh, this is huge. Let's keep reading. The newspaper article delved into a dispute between the FBI and the Justice Department. The inspector general also concluded that Mr. McCabe violated media policy of the FBI. And the, this is all, you know, we're reading the New York Times here. I'm not reading Cernovich.com. Uh, I'm not reading, you know, Infowars. I'm not reading, you know, so-called. This is the, the New York Times. I would think that's, you know, this is there. The report written by the Inspector General is delivered to Congress and was expected to be released publicly later in the day. But as we know, it's already on. McCabe. So McCabe is a uh, criminal. There's no... There's really no question about it, so we can read the full report here on the New York Times. dot com. Well, and this is this is crimes, people. This is criminal. This is not. This is not a game. He is a felon, not a convicted felon, but he is a criminal. He committed felonies. You know, you people are going, oh, oh, it's not really. You know, he could be. He's these are felonies, people. Let's read the report. A report of investigation of certain allegations relating to former FBI Deputy Director Andrew McCabe. Lack of candor. <laughs> um, lack of candor. That's what, um, that's what the FBI is saying, lack of candor. I see McCabe people are coming in here al along with um, fake racists and everybody, so I'm blocking them. So th that's what will happen is um, they're now, you know, McCabe bots are, are invading. 
Right. They're like, oh, yeah. Or they'll pretend to be racist and people will go, oh, multiple races. You know, I disavow all that nonsense. Lack of candor. <laughs> wow. I mean, I mean, this is the report. This is um, this is and and feels like a dream, but it's not. The conduct <laughs> lack of candor under oath, people. This conduct violated FBI offense. <laughs> lack of candor under oath. <laughs> Look, it's right here. Sorry, it won't highlight. This conduct violated FBI offense code. Here, I, I better tweet that out. Lack of candor under oath. This is not. Again, this is a felony. This is not garden variety obstruction of justice, which is, of course, a felony. This is under oath here. So let's go ahead and just read from the report. McCabe's conduct, because the, the mainstream media is going to bury this. Um, according to the inspector general, again, this is not um, not me. McCabe, the, CNN will bury this. McCabe's conduct... Vile, under oath. Uh, are you paying attention? Do you know what that means? CNN will not cover this. McCabe lied under oath. This is a serious felony. So yeah, I mean, you can go, you know, you can go find the report here. Lack of candor under oath multiple times, people. Jeez, lack of candor under oath multiple times. Multiple times. <sighs> so let's just keep reading again. Cernovich just provides you the news here, you know. That's why, that's why the media hates me because I, I provide the stories to other people. If, by the way, if you're on Facebook, like and share this video. If you're on Periscope, tap the screen. We find that when questioned under oath by FBI, McCabe lacked candor when he told the agents that he had not authorized the disclosure of the FBI and did not know who did. This violated offense, FBI Offense Code 2.6, lack of candor under oath. I mean, are you are, – McCabe, the deputy director of the FBI – Lied under oath. I don't know how, I don't know how bad it can get. Under oath. McCabe lied under oath multiple times. These are the people in charge of the FBI. These are the people, right? These people all lied under oath. People complaining about connection. Connection's fine for me. It's your connection. My connection's fine. Because I can, I'm watching Periscope in real time, so people go, oh, your connection's bad. No, it isn't, because I'm watching myself in real time. So your connection's bad, or, okay, so I'm blocking people who are complaining. Please just keep reading, ugh. You're blocked. You can never watch another Cernovich Periscope again. Who else wants to complain? Go ahead. Who else? Um, how's Trump doing? Numb nuts. You're blocked. Who else wants to complain about my coverage or my analysis? Go ahead. Who? Who? You know? Who else wants blocked because they want to complain? Go ahead. Block. Who? Who? Who else wants blocked? You want to complain about the journalism I provide? Because this is very, very serious stuff. So according to what I'm reading, McCabe lied under oath one, two, three, three times at least. So McCabe lied under oath at least. That's three separate felonies. So McCabe lied under oath three times. That's three felonies. According to the report, media, they're covering this up. According to the report, according to the... IG report, McCabe lied at least three times. 
under oath. He's got to be charged, really. I mean, this is felonies. Really, you know, it's kind of it's kind of like Bizarro World. So did Comey lie under oath also? Now we need a we need a second special counsel now. Because I mean this is unbelievable. Multiple multiple lies under oath. This is just really, really, really crazy. Which is where we are. Hold on, I'm gonna read your message. Yeah, so kind of hard to overstate how bad this is. This report's bad. Speaking of which, speaking of, it's Friday. I'm about to take, people go, what are you taking? I have product that I take. It's how I'm so productive. It's how I'm so productive in media and why other people are not as productive as me. GorillaMind.com. I have Gorilla Mind Nootropic. I take it for enhanced focus, better productivity. Gorilla Mind, G O R I L L A M I N D.com. I also have a sleep aid that I take every night. Gorilla Dream, which for me is incredible. I sleep well, I have vivid dreams. It's amazing, amazing stuff. But you gotta, you know, everything's on the label here in the back. Gorilla Mind. Dot com. It's the weekend. People need to sleep. I need to sleep. That's what I take. It's by far my favorite product. I wish I had to come up with it earlier. Wish I had to come up with it sooner. Gorillamind.com. For people who like to complain, go take your cholesterol medicine. Go take your doctor medicine. I always love people complain. Oh, sorry. Look at my blood work. I don't need cholesterol medication. I don't need high blood pressure medication. Why? Because I take care of myself. So people who run to the doctor because they don't take care of themselves are the ones who hate on me. Oh, I, I, I don't take, I don't take supplements. No, but you take poison from doctors. Did you read that New York Times article about antidepressants? Millions of women are on them. So yeah, go, you know, go, don't take care of your health. Don't be healthy like me. Don't be productive like me. Just, you know, complain. Complain that other people are healthy. Yeah, I don't have a CBD oil. A friend of mine actually has a CBD oil. But you can go to GorillaMind.com, G-O-R-I-L-L-A-M-I-N-D. -L -L it's easy to remember. GorillaMind.com. The product is called Gorilla Mind. The sleep aid is called Gorilla Dream. As you can see, we, we have Gorilla Motifs, the Gorilla Mindset, the book. We've got the Mindset, the book, Gorilla Mind. We just, or, you know, we're all just going gorillas. Gorilla Mind, bookmark it, go there, dot com. Lastly, we determined that as deputy director, McCabe was authorized to disclose the existence of the Clinton Foundation investigation publicly if it fell within the public interest exception. However, we concluded that McCabe's decision that confirmed the existence of the Clinton Foundation investigation through an anonymously sourced quote, recounting the content of a phone call with a senior department official in a manner designed to advance his personal interests at the expense of department leadership, was clearly not within the public interest. We therefore conclude that McCabe's disclosure of the existence of an ongoing investigation in this matter violated the FBI and the department's media policy and constitute misconduct. All right, so let me tell you how the media is going to spend this. All right. So here's how the media is going to spend all this. The media is going to say, oh, McCabe, watch it. I'm going to call it out in real time. Here's how the, the media is going to spend the McCabe report as media misconduct. Watch. I'm going to tweet this out. Tell me if I'm wrong. The IG report is damning. The media will spin it to say that McCabe violated the FBI's media policy. And they will ignore the 
findings that McCabe lied under oath three times and lied other times not under oath. Any civilian lying to the FBI would be prosecuted for felonies. So he, yeah, here's how the media is going to report it. Just watch. I'm going to tell you the narrative in real time because that's what I like to do. The media is going to say, according to the inspector general finding, McCabe violated the FBI's media policies. What say you, Cryon? What say you, panel? Panel is going to go, well, I don't know. He, was a, he quoted an article. He was a source of an article. It's not a big deal. That's how they're going to frame it. They're not going to say, yo, McCabe lied under oath three times, maybe more. I'm just reading the report right now. McCabe lied under oath three times, lied multiple times, not under oath. The media is not going to report on that. They're going to say, oh, you know, this report was all about just he talked to the press and he violated the media. That's how they're going to spin it is, well, McCabe, you know, he violated media policy and, you know, he shouldn't have talked to that reporter. You know, I can't believe McCabe talked to that reporter. Yeah, should FBI talk to reporters? That's how they're going to – that's how they're going to – that's how they're going to change it, right? That's how they're going to change it. You'll see. So the, the inspector general report is devastating. Don't fall for the media spin. By the way, I'm being quiet because my daughter's napping. So I'm not doing the usual, and we're back, Mike Cernovich. Gorilla mind. Dot. Daughter's taking a nap. I'm going to stay home, Dad. So don't let the media spin fool you. They're going to claim that, oh, he, he violated some kind of you know, media policy. But they're going to ignore the fact that he lied under oath multiple times to the FBI. Thanks for tuning in. Mike Cernovich, GorillaMind.com, G-O-R-I-L-L-A-M-I-N-D.com, GorillaMind.com. Check it out. I'm going to do a, my next Periscope. I'm going to do the White House press briefing. So I'll be back. If you're on Facebook, like the page, share the video. If you're on Periscope, tap the screen, turn on your notifications, because I'm going to come back and do the White House press briefing.